oh, when I was growing up, um, I used to have, it was a lot of um, singers and performers that I loved, like Regina Bell, Stephanie Mills, um, uh, In Vogue, I was like a diehard In Vogue fan. Oh my God, I thought they were the best ever. <laughs> and, but even as I, um, it's kind of weird because as I started becoming successful, I still was considered to have, be a kid, you know, a teenager or whatever with goals and dreams and people that I looked up to then was Queen Latifah, even though she's still doing her thing now, she was doing her thing then. I remember when our group was at some awards show for the Lady of Soul Awards one year. I think I probably was like 19, 18, 19. And she had won the Sammy Davis Jr. Award. I was 18. And that day, I said, you know what? And she had won the award because she was a, she had a management company that was successful. She was on the TV show. She had a rap career. And she had, like, had multiple things going on. So that day, that's when I said, you know what? I'm going to do that, too. And instead of just being a person and say, I want to do that, I said, I'm going to do that. So as soon as I got home, the first thing I did, I was trying to figure out, okay, now how many, how can I do a whole bunch of stuff to be successful at it? So I'm like, I'm already singing. Oh, okay, I'm going to be a manager, too, because I was looking at everything she had done. And I, um, I actually went to high school with um, Wingo from Jagged Edge. And um, I called him up. I was like, hey, you still in that group? Let me manage y'all. And I got <laughs> them they deal. Like, that was my first management thing. But even though I never want to manage anybody else again, but the point is it was like for her, she had accomplished something that I was like, oh, I want to do that. Mm -hmm. And so now for me, I try to set goals and make things happen and do things that other young women would say, oh, I want to do what Candy did. Like, I hope to be one day be you know, 50, 60 years old and getting the Lifetime Achievement Award and everybody's, you know, doing all the little tributes and stuff and saying all the accomplishments, you know. That's like a goal of mine that I would love to make happen, but that's why I said, you know, you just do multiple things and make it happen. I don't, I don't think there's anything that I can't do. And I know, I mean, I know maybe there, I'm sure there is the things that I can't do, but in my mind, I can do it. And I feel like that's all that people really need is to be their own motivator. Like, don't, you shouldn't have to have somebody saying, you can do it, you can do it. No, you tell yourself you can do it. You know, that's the main thing. Okay, so. I know you have to go.